another day at the office. Now, when it comes to Hooters, the 80s and 90s, that was like the place the old perverts would go because girls would show whatever they show. But nowadays, that's just a regular restaurant now. Like, that's like kind of like a wholesome w- restaurant, the way everything is now. The way everybody is at all these new restaurants, this is the, out with the old, in with the new type stuff. But we're going to see. I don't know how you're really going to measure who's a Hooters girl and who's not, bro. Because it's not like Hooters is a strip club or anything. I worked at Hooters. 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 I already got a suspect. This one right here. She has no... And this is the one that does... I guarantee she works there, but she's the only one that susses me out so far. Now, baby right there and baby right there. All right. Let's get down to business. (laughs) How old were you guys when you first applied? 21. 19. 20. 18. 18. 19. I was in college. I'm looking for body language. How bubbly are they? Hooter girls are typically pretty outgoing, outspoken. Did you guys all start a host? Not the ones hostesses? in Jacksonville. No, I started I'll tell you that now. as a waitress. Okay. Don't you have to be a hostess Server. first? Um, no, we'll not type all. Yeah, not all the time, yeah. yeah. It's like, it depends on your Uh-oh. experience. I had hosting Uh-oh. experience previously. Like, my location, you have to be a hostess first. Like, they don't hire you as a server unless you've worked at Hooters already. How did you guys, like, apply there? There was, like, an open hire, and I just, like, showed up and had an interview and got hired on the spot. I would just see it, like, constantly, and then I was just like, okay, well, might as well try. Uh, Riley was kind of suspicious. I don't know, it just sounded like... She was just making it up. I really just wanted a uniform, so I kind of just was like, <laughs> let's see what happens. And <laughs> Mine was because a friend worked there. Go to she Amazon. was like, why don't you just come with me and apply while I walk in? And I was like, okay. And then they hired me the same day. Hannah yeah, looks look like, like the Hooter ideal girl. Hooter girl, which is kind of sus. <laughs> My well, sister- I just said she looks like a Hooter girl as soon as Baby said it, bro. Now, I'm telling you now, her, even though she's the baddest one, she the biggest sus because, like, when old girl questioned her, she kind of looked dumb, and then the, this, this girl had her back. So, it might be her. Sister worked there, and then she was like, you should come work there, and I was like, okay. How did you start working there? I was on a date. <laughs> yeah, tutors. I had braces and everything. I didn't know what I was getting myself into, and then I was like, yeah, this is it. Hmm. Well, that's a come up to work at Hooters. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. If you like this episode, uh, figure out who the mole Thayer's alcohol-free toner with pure grade no. hazel hydrates for eight hours. That was a good time to hit that Thayer's. subscribe button. If I lost it all and I had to start from scratch, here's what I do to get back to six figures a year in four steps. So step. She was quieter and her body language was just, just a little bit more reserved. Yeah, she don't let it know that Hooters girl. She looks like a Hooters girl, but she's just pissed. quiet the whole if Riley was my waitress, I would be pissed. That defeats the whole person being there, bro. She's not pretty. Nothing against her. She don't have no tatas. I know she ain't got no culo. She just... <laughs> she like she work at Barnes & Noble. My entire time. I didn't expect to be out that early, I'm not gonna lie. Um, it was probably the piercings being left in because piercings aren't allowed. Everyone say Hooters makes you happy, but like really chippy. <laughs> Go ahead, you start. Okay. <laughs> Hooters makes you happy. <laughs> okay, I don't think I've ever said that phrase, but <laughs> Hooters makes you happy. <laughs> Hooters makes you happy. Hey. Hooters makes you happy. Hooters makes you happy. Okay. How about um, <laughs> we all follow up? And their wings are overrated as fuck, bro. Their wings are trash. Up with the next line of the birthday song. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. So, Hooters has a birthday song. Hooters has a birthday song. Not too oh, short. Not too long. I, I don't. I don't think I know that one. I know a different one. Oh. Yeah. Our Hooters had a Uh-oh. different one. Uh oh. How did yours go? <laughs> I would not really remember mine. <laughs> I know. I so long. Too short, not too long. Good thing is we sing for free. Yeah, it was a bad thing is we sing off key. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Don't say I remember that, that one. Yeah. Sing it right and get your wishes. Sing it wrong and do the dishes. Yeah. yeah. Sound off, happy sound off birthday. Break it all down. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. Yeah. I believe all of them. Mm. <laughs> you did good. So okay. what's the, what was your song though? Uh, it didn't start like that. It was, um, so it would come out and we would be like, okay, there's a birthday in the house. Mm-hmm. And then we would start off with, 
Let me try to remember how we started off. Uh-oh. Um, <laughs> Hooters has a birthday song. It's kind of the same yeah, thing. Yeah, it's the same thing. Hooters has a birthday song. Hooters has a birthday song. Not too short, not too long, not too short. It's the same thing, I guess. Yeah. She didn't know the birthday song. And then she said she learned a different one, but then no, she didn't know the second one either. So that threw me off, too. Um, OK, I have a question for you guys. What is one way to upsell? I would just sit in the booth with my customers, they bring out whatever it was, that, whether it was not. like the, you know, dessert. Bro, this is what I tell my homeboy. So we went to this uh, Mexican restaurant. Baby was bad. She was Puerto Rican, straight from Puerto Rico. My homeboy tried to hook me. I'm like, bro, waitresses always have boyfriends. There's no point of really trying. Like, they're just trying to get tips. So that's why I don't never, I'm not one of them people that try to, that try to flirt with the waitress. Like, because. They're, it's just like flirting with a stripper. They're only trying to get tips. You're not going to really get them like that, bro. They all have boyfriends. And they always tell you they got boyfriends. Or it's sort of like the calendar. I'd be like, you could buy this for me. Oh, they love that. They love that. They were like, oh, for you, I'll buy it. I don't I want it for you, myself. Yeah. But no. so, yeah. the desserts, I'd be like, oh, I really like this flavor. And they'll be like, oh, OK, get one. And I'll get one for myself. It's more for yeah. too. I'd be like, this is my uh, the key lime pie thing. Yeah. I'd be like, oh, if I get a chance, man, on my break. Like, I'll get some of this. <laughs> oh, you should get it, too, though, because we could share you for real. Yeah. yeah. You mentioned key lime pie. What are the other desserts? Caramel fudge cheese. Oh. Shh. Don't be. Mm, honestly, y'all, it's been a long time. It's for us. been so long. I also was just a hostess, so oh. I'm not gonna lie. I don't. Okay. I. I. Yeah. I, okay. Yeah. Um, <laughs> she was kind of just like stumbling on her words, Why are they and I was like, to try to upsell it. Do they really upsell Hooters? Like Hooters is just a restaurant, bro. What do they get out of upselling? Besides, does that make him a, get a bigger tip? They're not getting percentage of what they sell, so what's the point? Hmm. She just doesn't remember, or she truly wasn't a Hooter girl and just like doesn't know what to say. What's your favorite food on there? I liked the buffalo chicken salad. Beer cheese pretzel. Um, I like pickles. the. <laughs> oh, the fried pickles. Yeah. Pickles. pickles. Yeah. I like the buffalo fire. chicken quesadilla. Okay, favorite sauces. Daytona. Oh. That's what you're <laughs> Daytona, everybody knows. Daytona's the most famous one they got. Yeah, Yamani, you gotta go, bro. Yamani, out of that. Why would you pick Hannah, bro? She's the prototype. Dot Print when provides it comes hundreds to of ways girls. to personalize products for your home and bro, business. That's fast. I was thinking, like, I have this in the bag. Like, there's no way anyone's gonna vote me out, so I don't know. <laughs> if you think the mall is still in the box and you like to continue playing the game, Please raise your hand. So you're working at Hooters while you're in college, right? Yeah. When I was there, that's what was it. I didn't tell my parents or anything, too, because I don't know how they feel about it. But were you paying for college, too? Or I, like... I, yeah, I mean, I, I went when I was in undergrad. My whole family knew. I didn't care at all. I, I was trying to make money, and it was fine. <laughs> Hooters for me was more Not like a stripping. sorority, honestly. Like, I love all the girls that work there. Mm -hmm. I still keep in touch with them. Yeah, oh I goodness. met a lot of my best friends there, actually. Like, I'm still really close with a yeah. lot of the Hooter girls. OK, what is a blue moon served with? Orange. What about the daiquiri? Oh, I was never a server though. <laughs> I was a food runner. Oh, the cherry? Yes. I'm okay. not gonna get that. I would like, I would like know the ones that like my mom's got before, but like, that's Wait, what I was gonna say. That your mom's got before yeah. there? My moms are lesbian, they love Hooters. <laughs> Wait, but I thought your parents didn't know. <laughs> yeah, they don't. No, not while I'm there. No, 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 no. I mean like before. Like uh, I've gone to Hooters. She's with lying! Them. They, come, they no, caught they her! They come out to Hooters. Hooters. She's lying! They wouldn't. No, they wouldn't lie. If your mom's a lesbian and always goes there, why would your mom care about you working there? Huh? She, bro, Hannah, bro, the one that I thought the prototype is the is the culprit, bro. She lost. She the fucked up. They caught her. And Lena, whatever Lena, whatever her name is, she says she's an undergrad, so she probably went to school for something like a lawyer, doctor. So she knows, bro. She got the IQ, bro. Are you Wait, working? Wait, were you? No, my parents are strict about me, but not them. You know what I'm saying? Like I know because because they're like. 
this is gonna sound bad, but like they're sexualizing them, so I don't think they want me to be sexualized. I don't know. Yeah. I feel like your story is a little suspicious. <laughs> I understand. Yeah. I understand. Sus like, but I you look the part. You're cute. You're talkative. Like, thank you. Bubbly, yeah, yeah, but yeah. Yeah. I think all of us were kind of ganging up on Hannah because we were just a little bit suspicious. Part yeah. of me really wanted she to does. believe that she was a Hooter girl. She was selling it, but then there were just some things where I was like, mm, I don't think so. Okay, how do you guys say? How do you greet a guest when you come into Hooters? Okay, I'll just be like. Hi, welcome to Hooters. How's it going, guys? Hi, welcome to Hooters. <laughs> yeah, I guess the same thing, too. It's, hi, welcome to Hooters. Yeah, so I do. You guys all do this. I'd be like, hi, welcome to Hooters. You have to have a sweet customer service voice. Oh, yeah. You fake it. But yeah, all it's, the way. It, I mean, you're entertaining. I but. think we're actually hired as entertainers. We are hired yeah. as entertainers yeah, because you're not really. Hooter girls are entertainers. They audition for their roles. And once hired, they must maintain a glamorous appearance bro go i'm telling you bro if you could ever go to jacksonville florida hooters bro they are trash they are just like in, they, you might as well say they work at olive garden bro they don't have no entertainer skills bro they too busy talking to the cook like bro damn this is so cap like anybody did this back in the day <laughs> but nowadays bro Nah. Really allowed to like hire on a server and then have requirements about X, Y, Z. But as an entertainer, you're allowed to have those requirements. Did you guys take pictures with people and stuff like that? All the time. Yeah, yeah, for all sure. The time. For all sure. the little kids, all the birthdays. I know. Yeah, I know the little like yeah. the little boys are always in there with their dads. Yeah. <laughs> I'd prefer that though than like the creepy old guys. Oh, I'm like, yeah, the give way. me the teens. All like the whatever. Way. Okay. Really quick, what are the nail regulations and what type of nail can you get? Short, and then they can either be nude color no, or French. No, only, only say one type oh, of style. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. okay, well. I'll say it, I guess the next option is a shade of pink. Yes, a shade of but pink. But it cannot be a hot pink, it has to be a like neutral beige. tone. Yeah. Like skin color almost. What about hair? Down, they want it down yeah. and done. What color? Natural no, colors. Yeah, natural, natural colors. colors, they didn't natural want anything colors. bright, You guys crazy. are good. You guys I know, what I know, you guys. <laughs> Bro. Natural colors, they didn't want anything bright. You guys are good. Let me get them two. <laughs> bro, all, all I need is a shot with them two, bro. Uh, I'll be happy. They so bad. Good. I know. I know. I know you guys. <laughs> what do you guys all do now? So I'm in sales. I'm a sales representative, and I also teach kids um, how to play chess. Oh, cute. I work in the She's cannabis smart. industry slash bartender yeah, slash. Yeah, she's actually high right now, bro. I'm a physical therapist. I have my doctorate degree. No big deal. Wow. Hey. The Hooter girls are smart too. Yeah, really cool. yeah Hooter girls are smart. Um, I work at Sephora now. Cute. Nice. I'm like, oh, I know, I'm trying to I'm like, I, I almost believe you. I, I know believe you're. Because I'm sorry, I'm you're the think. most suspicious. Like, yeah. I cannot. It's because of the, it's because of the parents thing. Right? I just wonder what lie did you tell your parents that you were doing for work? Like, I only worked there for three months, oh. and I only worked there during the weekends. Yeah. Good Why'd job. you quit? They trust me because um, I needed to make more money, and they weren't bumping me up to server. Yeah, Why didn't they so. bump you up to server? Oh. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, I'm gonna be honest. Maybe my height, because I'm taller than you. I think. Yeah. I feel like yeah. it's yeah. always people. Yeah. 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 If you were tall, it was better because you would get more like yeah. front cover, like promo, Top like stuff. The... I like almost want to believe. <laughs> oh. Yeah, she's lying. Oh, the parents, she's lying. Go ahead, vote her out. We go ahead in the show now. They all. <laughs> she should have voted herself off. Yeah. <laughs> Your story just didn't match up. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> We're done. Game's over. Everything you wish for. Your site traffic is skyrocketing. You think the mole is still in the box and you'd like to continue playing the game, please raise your hand. That means the game is over. It's going to be green. If the lights turn green, that means you have voted out the mole and you all win. If it's not the green, it's lean, red, guaranteed. That means the mole is still in the box and you lose. Three, two, one. Green. Oh my oh gosh. My gosh. <laughs> I felt it, I felt it, I felt it. I was like, yeah. okay, this is totally like a Hooter. Yeah, like Hooter thing. vibe. Yeah, Hooter it was vibe. totally a Hooter vibe. Yeah. <laughs> On the count of three, can the mole please of course, step? Of Iggy Azalea. Three, two, one. Oh, no way! Oh my gosh! 
pressure. Thank God. I knew it. Our no, but. you had us. I, you had yeah. me. Good. You, were, you were close, though. Yeah, you, you were, were selling close. it. You were selling well, it. I watched like a lot of the Day in the Life YouTube videos of the Hooter girls. So I worked with um, an ex Hooters employee. She made me like a whole like study document. Um, we went over that. We practiced the birthday song. We were sitting there clapping, singing to it. I you should really I work was at a Hooters. Suit you yeah. 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 I was really about the parents thing. My moms would not be okay with that. Okay. Like, they definitely would not. My parents go, but they don't. They would not. They did not see, like me. See, that's what they, they, yeah. So when she said that, and you guys were suspicious, I'm like, oh. They love Hooters, but they don't love your daughter to my little brother. Yeah. I hid it from my parents for a while, but they literally couldn't have cared less. Yeah. I'm telling you now, bro. She my waitress. I'm walking out. I'm telling you now. Let's see who the girls come in all sizes, shapes. For real, though. You don't have to be hey. like the prettiest or the skinniest. Like honestly, Hooters will bring like the best out of you. It's just any other job. They're just pretty girls using their looks to an advantage. Um, clearly not an excessive not no admi advantage, but it's literally just like going to any other restaurant. It's just that we look hotter. <laughs> and then the worst part is when you tell someone you work like worked or work at Hooters, like. Yeah. Oh, oh, that, and that's like what? What do you mean? What? Like it's a family restaurant. Kids come for their birthdays. Exactly. At my restaurant, kids eat free like, on Sunday, so that was like the specialty. Um, I definitely think it actually sounds like a great job. Like it seems very woman-like led. I also noticed they were talking about how you can get guys kicked out easily. That it really seems like you're the focus of the restaurant, and that's really important, especially as a girl. Yeah, that. there's like this like, bad oh. stigma around it. Oh, but yeah, honestly, yeah. I feel like Hooters really molded me. It really empowered me and got me out of my shell to become more of a girly girl, more confident, mm -hmm. and just really generate like lifelong friendships. Hey! 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 Hey!